Hello and welcome to this walkthrough of the Network Assessor for Skype for Business Online and Microsoft Teams. This is a free tool that functions as a front end to Microsoft's Network Assessment command line tool that was released at the end of 2016. Microsoft created their Network Assessment tool to allow businesses a simple way to do basic network assessments for Office 365 real-time media workloads such as Skype for Business Online and Microsoft Teams. One of the key features of this tool is that it can be used even prior to setting up an Office 365 tenant. The current version of this tool is 6.0.8969.164. When the Microsoft command line tool is executed, it will create an audio stream that it sends to Office 365 via your internet connection. The nearest geographically located Office 365 network We'll then loop back the media stream to the tool, and based on an assessment of the returning stream, it will display some statistics. These include packet loss rate, round trip latency, average jitter, and packet reorder ratio. Microsoft's tool is great for offering sites the ability to test network connectivity into the Office 365 network using real media streams generated using the actual Skype for Business media stack. So as you might imagine, this tool is very useful for sites that are looking into deploying applications that use real-time media. However, there are a few areas where I thought it could do with some additional features, so I built a front-end user interface for the tool that I call Network Assessor for Skype for Business Online and Microsoft Teams. Version 1.0 of the Network Assessor tool offers the following features. Automatic download and installation of the Microsoft command line tool and Visual C++ prerequisite using the Help Install Microsoft Tool menu item. Real-time graphs for packet loss, average jitter, latency and reorder ratio. Configurable test frequency rate with a range between 1 minute and 2 hours. Highlighting of points on each graph that are outside of Microsoft's recommended operating bounds. The ability to zoom in, out, and pan graphs forwards and backwards to view data clearly. System tray icon color control based on configurable threshold values, allowing a quick view of the current session status without having to open the interface. Saving graphs as PNG images for use in documentation or management presentations and reports. Selecting individual or all graphs to be displayed in the interface. CSV-based logging of sessions, allowing for the permanent history of testing sessions for future reference. The ability to import previous session CSV files. That wraps up the features for version 1.0. If you would like more details or to download the tool, please visit myskypelab.com. Thanks for watching.